Hi everyone and welcome back to another video. In this short tutorial, I'm going to be showing you how you can add video into any icon or any shape easily in PowerPoint. So let's jump straight into it. As usual, we're going to start with a blank presentation. So we'll go to File, Blank Presentation, right click, choose Layout and choose Blank. Now let's add the icons. For this first example, I'm going to go to Insert Icon and type Duck. Click here and click Insert. To size this up, we can hold down Control and Shift, click and drag from the corner. And to be able to add video into this shape, we need to right click and choose Convert Shape. Now we can add the video by going to Insert, Video, Stock Videos, and type Duck. I'm going to click on this and then click Insert. For reference, we want to right click on this video and choose Centre Back. And again, we can hold down Control and Shift, click and drag on the corner point and size it down. Now is where the magic happens. So while the video is selected, we'll hold Shift and click on the duck. And then you notice that because it's a video, you can't go to Shape Format. If it wasn't a video, I'll just give you an example here. You could just add that. If you click on the duck and then hold down Shift, click on the rectangle. You can go to Shape Format and choose Merge Shapes. But there is a clever way how we can get to Merge Shapes when we're on the video. You can right click on Merge Shapes and choose Add to Quick Access Toolbar. I've actually already got it in, so I'm just going to remove it from my Quick Access Toolbar and then show you. So under Shape Format, and to get to it, remember you have to have two shapes selected. So one shape, hold down Shift, select another shape. Then under Shape Format, the Merge Shapes option will become available. We can right click and choose Add to Quick Access Toolbar. And it's going to appear there in my Quick Access Toolbar. Your Quick Access Toolbar may be at the top or under the ribbon. You can change the position of that by going to this drop down here and choosing Show Above the Ribbon or Show Below the Ribbon. So I'll choose Show Above the Ribbon. Now you can see it appear here. Unless you've added all these custom ones in as I have, the default is only to have a few in, but you'll still have this drop down here. So show below the ribbon. And for any reason, if you hide the quick access toolbar, you can always get it back by going to File, Options, and then choosing it here. Quick access toolbar, show quick access toolbar, and you can adjust the position here. I choose below ribbon. So now you have this quick access toolbar which I would always recommend you have turned on because it's very useful in quickly getting to command you use all the time. So now I can delete this rectangle, click on the video first, hold down shift, click on the icon, and you'll see we don't have shape format there, so you can't get to merge shapes that way. But in our quick access toolbar, it's available. So I can go to merge shapes and choose intersect. And now I have the video inside of the icon. I can go to playback and choose automatically. The video will automatically play back inside the icon. You can right click on the background and add any picture you want. So for example, I just went here, clicked on this one. Now you have the video inside the icon. You can move it about and size it exactly as you want and position it anywhere. So we'll just do one more quick example. I'll right click, choose new slide. Insert icon and type ice. I'm going to select this one here. Click on it, hold down control and shift. Click on the corner point and drag. Now we need to convert this into a shape, which we can do by right clicking and saying convert shape. We also need to ungroup it. So go to group, ungroup, because in this icon there's two parts to it. And then go to our merge shapes on the quick access toolbar and choose union. That basically joins it up into one complete shape and allows us to put the video in it. So now we can go to Insert Video, Stock Videos, type ICE, click on this and click Insert, click on the video, right click and choose Centre Back, then hold down Control and Shift, click on the corner point and drag in. That looks good. And now while the video is still selected, hold down Shift, click on the icon, then go to the Merge Shapes option on your Quick Access Toolbar and choose Intersect. Now you have the video, go to playback, choose automatically, and it will play back inside the icon. 
just quickly add the background in by right clicking on the white background, going to format background, going to picture or texture fill, clicking insert, choosing stock images. I typed ice and selected this and clicked insert. Great, a really cool effect that you can use with any icon and any shape. If you have a short clip, you can set the video to loop. So you can click on the video, go to playback, choose loop until stopped. So I can set that for both of these now. Playback, loop until stopped. It will continue to loop the video. So by adding video into icons, you can get a really cool way to bring your slides to life. If you'd like to download any of the source files used in these tutorials, there's a link to my Patreon in the description below. And if you want to become a PowerPoint expert and make stunning slides, then watch the next video. Thanks very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you liked it, please click the like button. If you want to see more, hit subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.